Oh, uh, welcome back. It's been a long weekend, and uh, I'm uh, a little running on empty just a little bit because me and Coconut Crow were working on an animation together, and I don't want to spoil it, but we're not animators. Um, we're more like uh, theoretical animators, like aspiring animators. And, um, uh, basically, we thought it would be cool if we had a sleepover where we did nothing but animate. <laughs> and, uh, it went better than I thought it would. I've been really excited about it. And, um, when it's done, it's going to be available on my YouTube, so check it out. It's, like, a little, a cute little cartoon, like a short, short, like, um, less than a minute long kind of little animation. Uh, and it took non-stop working on it over 24 hours to get like halfway done so <laughs> um but anyway today we're playing roblox again but i'm gonna do one that i haven't done before by request it's one called doodle world let's see i'm just gonna send a notification in chat that we're doing it let's see mm -hmm. doodle world And I'm going to join the server that my friend is playing on. I mean, Roblox friend? I guess the more accurate term would be a, a, a Twitch follower. Because <laughs> they all friended me on Roblox so I could play with them. <laughs> uh, let's see, where are they? Do, 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 do. Axolotl. So they probably saw the notification. They're not playing anymore. Sorry, just getting everything organized. Here we go. You can see I haven't played this before, so we're going to be doing the intro. Um, all I've seen so far is I've hit new game, and this person who is presumably like my friend or something is like, is like, hey, check out this tournament poster. The winner gets so much money. Hey, Axolotl. I am looking at the intro right now. Do, 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 do. The winner gets so much money, I could finally travel around the world. Oh, that's right. Let's turn the sound on. Do, do, do. I did provide for you the past few years. Oh, it's mom. Hi, mom. I like her dress. Don't give me that look. Isn't doodle battling one of the most popular sports on this island? Don't ask me. And they even provide you a free beginner doodle. It says this competition starts in one month. You're going to be entering this. Oh, I am, huh? One month later. Hey, it's me. <laughs> Today's the tank. Go, go to the doodle laboratory to get your very first doodle. And remember, if you need to rest, you can always talk to your mom inside your house. Okay, so very Pokemon. I'm getting the sense that that's the inspiration. These are not the original proportions I made my character in, but this is basically the look I was going for. I just wanted it to be a robot with a picture of a wolf. <laughs> Let's see. They made me cuter than I am in real life. 
so um axolotl i'm not sure if you can join the server i'm on if it's not already too full let me know if you can't and then we can just uh use a different one so far this seems like a pretty well-made thing i was excited when i saw that you could actually battle your monsters because that's something that um a couple of pet games i tried didn't have <laughs> doors to open when you run into them. Doodle Co. Professor. They don't pay me enough for this. Hello, are you here for the key finding competition? <laughs> I must not like his, uh, his tournament job. Considering today is one of the last days to enter the competition, you must be. Everyone who enters this competition gets their own free complimentary beginner doodle. Follow me. Note. Accepting this beginner doodle means you verbally sign our waiver. If you get hurt hunting for keys, Doodleco will not be held responsible. Ah, sending children on dangerous quests is just like Pokemon. <coughs> Sorry, I had to cough. Using that screen, you can have the Doodle Machine create your partner. Oh. Which Doodle will you pick? <laughs> I wonder if this is a real loading screen or just a prop. Either way, it's pretty cute. P Plupski? Type ice, dude. How am I not- I mean, look at me. How am I not gonna be this one? But let's see what else they have. Vipember. Ooh. A tablet. That's so cute. A speedster, a bulky attacker. Okay, so they're using elemental types, but they're also using, like, RPG combat tactics. <laughs> Scrappy. <laughs> I have to be Pupski. I mean, look at me. Type ice. Balanced. Yes. You've gotten the Pupski from the Doodle Machine. You picked Pupski. Not a bad choice. Pupski are extremely loyal and good companions. Heck yeah. Blind Beans. Soup Boy here. What's going on? Hey, Soup Boy. I'm starting a game of Doodle Monsters, which is a basically a Roblox, a Roblox clone of Pokemon. So far, it's going great. I picked something that looked almost exactly like me, so it's perfect. Now let's test out your new Doodle in a Doodle Battle. Doodle Co. Professor wants to battle. You sent out Pupski. Tortles. No, he cute. Pupski is Howl. Attack was boosted. Ooh. <laughs> so we cancel each other out. Let's go for the fight. Beans is resting, but she should be up somewhat soon. Cool. So they did hard it again. I should just keep going for it before they get too hard to fight. With hardened types, you gotta just go fast. <laughs> fast and hard. I wonder if there's like, I wonder if we can like hit the number keys as like, like quick buttons. Probably not. And I mean, full health too. That was probably intentional. I got money. That puppy t sure is pro uh, powerful. Make sure to keep your doodles healthy after every battle. I'm here for my rare doodle. Oh no, it's my rival? Question mark. Master Quincy. He's got a butler. Please refrain from screaming while inside buildings. Soup says, "Oh, she's awake. I'll let her have the laptop before she hits me." You know. It's okay if you also have a laptop. Like, if you have a laptop and you bring it with you, then you won't have to steal her so much. <laughs> Beans! Hey, Beans! How has my day been? It's been pretty busy. I went to the store, and then I went to a store that's, like, twice as expensive as usual, and I didn't notice, and I just started throwing everything in the cart, and then when I got to the cashier, he's like, you owe me, like, $55, and I'm like, $55? Why? <laughs> And then I'm like, I had a hundred. Like, what's the problem? 
And then he's like, well, your total came out to like 200. And I'm like, what? <laughs> so we had to go back and try again. <laughs> so that's my day so far. Oh, so also before that, you guys didn't hear this, uh, but um, at the beginning of the recording, I was talking about how I spent like all all weekend like a hundred percent of the weekend working on this little cartoon animation um <laughs> with my ex who i'm friends with and uh we made like a pizza party out of it and i'm really proud of how it's been going it's just like a cute little animation about a fox it's like 17 seconds long it's great anyway yeah so right now we're basically playing pokemon welcome master quincy please refrain from screaming while inside buildings Whatever, we're only going to be in this cruddy town for the next hour. <laughs> Very well, Master Quincy. I will prepare your father's private jet so we can leave immediately as soon as we're done here. <laughs> Where is the Professor Reginald? Why didn't he come meet me at the door? It seems like the Professor is preoccupied with someone else, Master Quincy. <laughs> it's like Batman, but except if he was a dirtbag. <laughs> Look at this blue robot man, how dare he. You're entering Doodleco's key finding competition? Don't make me laugh, a poor loser like you having any chance. <laughs> you can't call me a loser if my wins in this game is 100% wins and 0% losses. I bet yours aren't 100% wins. Now move out of the way, loser. My dad owns 30% of this island. Yeah, well, we're standing on the other 70%, so it doesn't matter. <laughs> I'm sorry, sir, but this machine can only be used once every 20 minutes. I said get out of the way! Listen. <laughs> if, this if this person existed in real life, of course they're... This is just a villain. We're not supposed to like them. But if this happened in real life, they would get kicked out immediately. This is so funny. Master Quincy, please be reasonable about this. This poor butler. Can you imagine his everyday life? I have to wait another 20 minutes. <laughs> the type of person <laughs> who hears but doesn't listen. <laughs> Do you know how people settle their arguments on this island? With a doodle battle! I don't remember being in an argument with this guy. <laughs> His face, I know. <laughs> if I win, I get to keep your pupski. No, I'm pretty sure, one, I didn't agree to that, and two, that's probably illegal. <laughs> Rich boy Quincy wants to battle. I'm gonna absolutely stomp him. Of course I'm gonna stomp him. Shell, though. I'm assuming this guy is another hardened type. And it looks like Bite's good against him, so let's just go full offense. Oh, dude. <laughs> Defense was lowered. Mm -hmm. Full Bite. Now's your chance to give me your... I'm not sure what you're saying, but hey, you're welcome. Also, Kefty, I don't think I've seen you in this stream before. If, you, if you're if you new, uh, welcome. I'm glad you're here. Pupski leveled up. That's right, this nerd. Who's the loser now? Ha 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 ha. Ooh, we got more than one level. We got to seven. Nice. I, lo I got Snowball. Ooh, that's gonna be fun. I won the battle and I got the rich kid's money. Yes! I lost. The private jet is ready, Master Quincy. <laughs> this isn't over! <laughs> he runs out of him crying. I am terribly sorry for my master's behavior. It's okay. I know he's just off his meds. <laughs> He'll be fine tomorrow. <laughs> Some people just have off days. <laughs> As apologies, I will tell you the location of the closest key. The next key is near Graphite Lodge. The master is also in the key finding competition, so we will probably see each other again. You know, Reginald, you're a solid dude, and I hope we see each other again. You're cool. Reginald, what's taking you so long? 
I need huggies and kisses. <laughs> Well, that was, uh, interesting. <laughs> anyway, for the competition, it would be unwise to send you out an adventure without a complimentary starter kit. Yeah, probably. <laughs> you got five basic capsules and the Doodlepedia. Aha. Uh -huh. You can use these capsules to capture wild doodles that you encounter in the wild. You can't trade or release this pup ski because it's proof that you signed our safety waiver. <laughs> However, if you want to purchase the starter that you can trade, feel free to talk to me. Oh, okay, so you can get the other ones. I think the next order of business is for you to go to Lakewood Town, which is the closest nearby town. Good luck. Alright, cool. So we are on our adventure. Probably there's going to be, like, more tutorial quests or something like that, but maybe not. Oh, that's weird. I went to move the camera and it doesn't move in this, in this building. I wonder if there's, like, an inspect button, or is it just... Running to stop it, that stuff. Oh, Axolotl's in the in the uh, in the list of people who are on. Excellent. A trade request. I have no idea how to get to that. Special settings, Doodlepedia party, backpack, customized passport. Probably in social. Axolotl accept trade. Oh, I see. Interesting. Love that avatar. Little dance is great. Goggle gang. I'm not sure what that means, but cool. You got some real cuties. Are you giving these to me for just just because? That's really sweet of you. Uh, sure. It's nice that you can do that. Noodles. <laughs> Alright, let me check these out. Wikipedia party. It's a Bengalux and a Borbo. They're both around the level that I'm at. Stats. What is a Borbo? It looks like a bird. Its size is 106%. Its tint is dark green. Okay, so that's not the usual color. Basic and air. Let's see, it's got high health and low magic. Ignores targets evasion. Okay, so maybe. Um, hmm. This is adorable. <laughs> and this is a Bangalux. We got a lightning. Doodle speed can't be lowered. If the doodle speed would be lowered, boost it instead. Ooh. That's gonna be really useful against those debuff types. Gain sympathy points. Nice, nice, nice. <laughs> Bean says, just the word noodles. Yeah, that's valid. I love noodles. It was a good word, too. This is the one I went with, by the way. This pupski. It's like, it's basically me. Their fur is cool to the touch, and their tongues are even colder. That's awesome. I mean, pupski is cold because they're an ice elemental, and I'm cold because I'm a ghost. I like the laugh. Let's see. Here's my pup. Ooh, good pup. 
follow the path through Route 1 and Route 2. So this is probably, yeah, that's the starting area. It's a little cul-de-sac where I can heal up at mom's. When your friend texts you and then you uh, wander but they go offline, sad bean. Oh, answer. <laughs> Wow, this guy's got a specific aesthetic. This is one of the worst vacation spots in the entire region. Oh, you live here? I'm sorry about that. Here, have some money since you need it more than me. Why can't all rich people be like that? Just be like, yo, this place sucks, here's some money. Honestly, super awesome. I mean, like, that's how I wish people would treat me in real life. Just like, whoa, what the hell's wrong with you? Here's a 20. <laughs> I had a difficult time picking my beginner doodle. I went with my gut instinct and picked the one I liked the most. Yeah, that's how it works. That's how everything should work. Make yourself happy. This town's population was dwindling until Dudico built the laboratory. Now this town is thriving. Nice. I'm gonna talk to everybody because the first person I talked to gave me a thousand dollars. I'm gonna recreate the magic somehow. My family and I always wanted to move to an island. With Doodleco's competition, we made this dream a reality. Very good. Oh, this is like a basketball court. What is that, a cop? Yeah, we don't talk to cops. Remember, kids, never talk to cops. Psst, do you want to look at my wares? Yes. Interesting. Well, a bandage is probably a good idea. Let's get two. Thank you for your purchase. Canada. I suppose we could have one of each of these. I have enough, so let's go for it. Stack candy. Huh. Level down cube. What? And then... Purchased currency? Because this is our dollars. Interesting. Oh, there's a chest over there. Oh, I think I was rewarded for exploring. Who are you? This is an exciting basketball game I'm watching. Don't bother me. Oh, sorry. I mean, okay, sure. Nobody here, but, you know, it's in his head, I think. I think he's just having a good time imagining a, bas a basketball game. Yes, I've got 150 gems. Don't know what that is, but I got them. All right, now that I've goofed off enough. This is very peaceful. I like the music and the design is pretty good. The maximum, the maximum level of a doodle when you have no keys is 20. When you collect keys, you also raise the max maximum level you can raise your doodles. Nice. I don't know why I can't say maximum today. I mean, do I get anything for going to the water? Well, I can't go in the water. Okay. <laughs> Sketch fail. Reward doodle beginner title. Doodlepedia progress is zero out of three. I'm on Route 1. I think that means I can be attacked randomly. Totally. Kid Johnny, if two tamers meet eyes, a battle starts. Good to know. <laughs> Beans, ah yes, I love watching Oxygen play basketball. You know, not many people know that, that Oxygen actually plays basketball very frequently. It's a uh, so favorite past on it first. Looks like Bite does good, so let's do Bite, of course. These poor bugs. Rosebud. Aww. Poor cutie. I'm not sure what type this is, but I 
that seems to be just fine against bugs. <laughs> Bean says, it plays basketball with atoms and electrons. Yeah, see, that's what it is. He's watching the, the atomic structure of molecules changing. In front of his eyes. That guy must be... <laughs> that guy must have, like, microscopes in his face instead of eyeballs. You're pretty strong. <laughs> Thanks, I'm actually, uh, like, a 100% beginner. And I have uh, only only done one battle so far. Oh, I get it. This is tall grass. Oh, look at that cutie. Why? It's even got sprinkles. Are you kidding me? Well, I have to catch this. Hold on. Snowball is not super effective on it. Gotta get a bun. Yeah. Nice tackle. Nice. Gotta get capsules. Yeah. Fun suit was caught and added to the party. Ooh, and you get experience for catching. That's so nice. Pupski is getting HP, magic attack, and speed. I'm not like I'll 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 be honest, okay? I have played so many Pokemon games for such a long time. Pokemon was the first game I ever got, and I was like seven, and I've been playing it a lot since then. But I'll be the first person to tell you I'm not good at it. You know, I'm one of those people where like if I grind enough, I can work something out. But am I good at tight matchups or remembering stats or things like that? And I'm not. Very much not. Oh, that's a Borbo. It's so cute. This one's weak against snow. Ah, <coughs> uh, yeah, super effective. There we go. Feel bad for beat up, little cutie. Corbo. Maybe I should use my other creatures so that Pepsi will be available to fight the hard battles. Corbo. Yeah, I'll use other creatures for um, for capturing next time. Hello, fight me. Last Rachel. I got this doodle from my father. Nice. All done, sweet, huh? I've got a bite for that. Spicy tackle. Oh no, I got spiced. Know that I'll do it. Experience. Yes. I doubt it will buy me a better deal. <laughs> oh yeah, they probably talk to them. But when I get older. Yeah, probably. I mean like, you know, looking after pets is hard. And um honestly, okay. I said this already in a Minecraft stream. But if we're going to be honest here, I don't think children can or should own pets. If you buy a pet for your kid, you own the pet, and it's your pet. You can 100%, 100% like, expect the child to participate in the raising of the pet, but they're a child and they're a beginner pet owner, they're never going to be able to do the whole thing by themselves. It's just not possible. You gotta make sure that if you buy a pet, it's a pet that you can look after and not just the person you're giving it to. Now that way it's more fair on the kid because they won't be responsible if something bad happens. Let's use Bangalux in the front and see how that works out.
and that'll be for like catching and stuff. I think this says two out of three. Yep, because there's one more that I haven't found yet. So I want to make sure I get all of them here and maybe in all the regions if possible. But I won't be too mad if I don't. Rosebug. So Shock is good against Rosebug, but Taser's not. Um, let's see, this is a power 50 and type spark. This is also type spark. This is a magic, this is support. Oh, I see. Hmm. Low amp bolt at the target. If it hits the target, it paralyzes them. That should help. Attacks lower. So Ben Deluxe is a great support character. Oh, nice. And they have the, the speed opposition. Looks like Bengalux is really good at catching. Yes. Ooh, nice. I'm now a doodle beginner. I have to go back to Mom and heal. Too bad you can't pick which um, which doodle follows you outside. I guess it makes sense that it'd be your lead. Such a cute doodle. You can always rest up here if you wish to do so. Okay, cool. How do I rest? Is it in front of the TV? Is it in the room? Oh, it is in the room. Her chest. Memento. Let's check that out. speaking metaphorically. I don't really get it. Ah. Oh, I see. Nice. It doesn't keep your zoom level when you go back to the open world after fighting or being in a house. That's okay, it's not that bad. I'm gonna just blast through the grass. Oh, we got caught. Probably should have used my dog.
Actually, yeah, since I caught everything there, I'm gonna switch. No way. Fight me. <laughs> Crusher Brandon. I take pride in beating new tamers. Do you? That's kind of a crummy thing to take pride in. I'd be ashamed of myself if I said that. I'm trying to bite. Oh. Pupa. It's a snowball. Okay, so that's 50. This is also 50. The both accuracy 100. 50 power. So. They're mostly equivalent, except that this one is a beast physical, this one is a ice magical. Interesting. What am I better in? I want to see if Pupski is a physical or a magical. Looks like they're about equivalent. Okay. Hi, Borbo. Getting more magic attack, but that was, that was equal to. Okay. Interesting. The only thing that Hubsky seems to not be doing is defense. So he might turn into a bit of a glass cannon. That's totally fine. I lost to you. What has happened to my skill? <laughs> it's okay. Your skill's fine. Maybe I'm just not quite as noob as you thought. No, I'm super noob. Anything below 20 is obviously noob. Snowball the bird. Sorry, bird. You're very cute, but you're bad against snow. Ugh. Imagine that in real life. That'd be funny but sad. Just like a little bird, and they're like standing under like a branch, and then the branch drops snow on their head. And the bird's like, ah! Go, oh, Pupski. Literally just a magical husky, which I love. Every time I see a husky in real life, I'm like, ho oh, ho ho ho, a baby. <laughs> Talk to you in a second, I wanna get this thing. Heal Joey. Probably an advanced healing item. Hello? Oh, he does want to fight. Cool Team Beckett. Sup, kid? I can't let you pass. Uh, well, it's ironic because I just did, but you know what? I'm gonna give you a chance here. Glimmu. Aw. Hmm. Either one's good, so I have more fights, so I'll do that. Got a pretty tough one, huh? Not bad, I respect. You passed the test! Oh, I'm glad I'm not ruining his reputation. If I pass the test, then I can tell him I already got the item from the chest and he won't mind. We know we cut everything in this uh, area. I might avoid most of the grass because I don't think we need to grind yet. Hiker Miles. My goal is to climb all the mountains in the world. 
That's really admirable. I like the uh, the outdoorsy aspirations. It's very very healthy. Squid. What is that thing? <laughs> square head. I get it. But what the heck? And it's wearing little. It's wearing a little onesie. Oh, okay. Have a snowball. He did not like the snowball. I'm so sorry. Yeehaw. Yep, still no defense. This is gonna be one difficult pub. Looks like you're a mountain I can't climb. You know, uh, yeah, not without consent, buddy. Let's see. JX Pod. Hey, thank you so much for the follow. I hope you are enjoying. Oh, he got me. Kid Bobby. We're almost at the end of this route. Let's get a quick battle in. Yeah, sounds good. Kid Bobby wants to battle. You sent out Plutsky. You sent out Borbo. Aw, Borbo. Sorry, Borbo. Oh, yeah, I want to check on Lick. Power 30, basic physical. The user licks the target with its tongue, having a chance to lower the target's attack. Which, uh, how old does the boost version of that? So, okay, so Pupsky, Pupsky's good at controlling attack power. We might as well start with Lick. It's a good thing to start with. Probably in a longer battle, but yeah. Let's go for the snow. <laughs> I'm so sorry, Borbo. You're so cute. Goodbye. Dang it, dang. Lippo? <gasps> what is that? What's a plippo? Oh no, it's so cute. Are you kidding me? What does this do? Oh, nice. It gives me a, a chart. Okay. So. So things I'm good at are fire. Wait, no. Fire is what I need to watch out for. Of course, that makes sense. I want this chart. Ice is, oh, it's both ways. Let's get it against fire, plant, uh, beast, uh, earth. All right, fire, plant, beast, and earth. And I need to watch out for fire, uh, melee, and metal. Okay. What the heck is a Plippo? Look at how cute it is. All right, Plippo, time to die. Ooh, Plippo's got good defense. Plippo begged for money. We would kill it fast. We're not taking any money. We don't stand. Hey, honor among thieves, okay? We only steal from people who have a lot. I don't. <laughs> I'm just kidding, kids. Stealing is wrong, wink. That's not a real wink. I'm just winking because I have something in my eye. HP and attack. Okay, yeah. It's good that it's good that Pusky keeps getting HP. And, and what was your what was your losing dialogue? Uh, Kid Bobby just says, "Meh." See, that's a that's a fairly good attitude. He didn't have any sass for me. He didn't make any excuses. It's just like you can't win them all. You know that's really true. Excuse me. Ah, who who is that? Ouchie! I'm so sorry. Who is this weeb? My name is Inari. Really? Not my real name, of course. I'm a shinobi in training. Really? <laughs> and since I accidentally bumped into you, I broke rule 8 of the shinobi code! Oh no! Is that the one that says don't harm civilians? Or is that the one that says watch where you burn? <laughs> if my elder finds out about this, he will fail me, and my path in life will be decided by the game. They decided that you should get an ice cream party. <laughs> it's not so bad. 
I can't have that happen. If you win this doodle battle, you must keep silent. Listen, I was gonna agree to it anyway. But I need an excuse to keep my pup healthy, so let's do it. Nice, set up. Kicks it. That's freaking adorable. For anybody who doesn't know, Inari is a uh, is a god in, uh, in Shinto Japanese mythology, and um, among other things, she is represented by foxes, and so that's why the person named Inari has a fox. Um, it says that it's not that she's a fox, and it's not that she represents foxes, but rather that foxes act as her lord and messenger. So, in Japanese culture, it's polite, it's like a good idea to be polite to foxes in case it's one of the Inari's foxes. What is this? Alright, well, time to die. You're level 7, I'm not that worried. Oh yeah, that was a one hit. Bye, Kitson. What a damn it. Oh, we got the level 12. <laughs> this poor person. Wait, you mustn't tell a soul about this! I'm the first ever girl from my clan to try and become a shinobi. I can't fail now! If I give you my equipment case and katana, will you not tell anybody? Listen, if you give me your katana, everybody's gonna know anyway. <laughs> I say yes? Wow, this character is mean. Okay, okay, take it. I got the equipment case and the decorative katana. Why would I take these things from this poor girl? All she did was bump into me. You can give pieces of equipment to any one of your doodles to make them stronger. Now goodbye. I hope we never meet again. Shinobi smoke screen. Oh my god, my character is a uh, rude, 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 rude boy. <laughs> Alright, let's see what we got. Oh yeah. No jelly. Oh, I see. It's a held item. Equipment case. Helmets, amulets, and artifacts. Attack and speed. Okay. I will definitely give it to Pupski. Speed is good for someone with low defense. And we came out of that with most of our health, so that's good. Okay, so it looks like there's new doodles in this area. Two of them. I will catch them, no problem. I have plenty of doodles of my own, and I have plenty of capsule things. So it shouldn't be an issue. Bring Lux back to the front. And Niblin. What a cutie. I mean, they're all cuties. Mostly, anyway. Thirty-five attack lower. Paralyze. Let's go for paralyze. Nice. Oh yeah, Bangalux against bugs is really good because of web. Um, and let's try a swipe because it's nice and low. Oof! Oh, it was level 3. That's good. This is an excellent scenario for capture. Sweet. 
let's just let's just run. Now it's only a one out of three chance that we're gonna find a new one, so I'm gonna do a bunch of running. Run, run. Mission failed successfully. Our luck's not doing too well right now. I mean, Ben Lux is doing fine. But our luck. There's probably going to be, like, tall grass that we can't avoid, so maybe we'll bust up Pendulux during those times. No, wait, here we go. This is a flippo. What a cutie. Start with the taser. Oh, good. Good lord, my attack. Perfect. This should make it easy not to accidentally kill them. Defense wants boosted. Perfect. Nice. Receive nature color. Good, I love nature color. Is that customize? Nature. Did that do it? Oh yeah. I think that looks honestly kind of terrible, but I'm pleased that I got it. I didn't realize they had a sign yet. I'm going to equip that. Alright, time to get out of the tall grass and do some battles. Switch out the upski. Nice, nice, nice. And what are you up to? Businessman Douglas. Do you know your way around? I'm lost. This poor man just wants directions. Well, I'll let Pupski explain it to you. Rough fire? Ooh. Like sapphire? Is this like a crystal Pokemon? Well, Snowball's good at it. What does that mean? Snowball's good at it, then it has to be. Not a plant. Might be an error of earth. Interesting. Well, let's go for the hard hit. Yes! Got the one hit. We've been erased. I'm gonna get fired. This poor man. See, Pupski was trying to explain it, but um, he just got too excited. Sorry about that. It's uh, actually uh, down this path and then to the right. Look at there. <laughs> Fight me. It's Kid Billy. Look at this doodle that you've probably never seen before. I'll be the judge of that. Kid Billy sends out Needling. Ah, you're right. I am not. It's so cute. It's a little cactus. It's a little succulent with a little succulent flower on a succulent head. Ugh, oh, adorable. You're right. I haven't seen it before. Thank you so much, Billy. 
one hit, one hit. Yes, one hit! Nice, 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 nice. Drats, I lost. Who says drats? That's amazing. I'm so sorry. I got my needling in a desert. You know what, that makes sense. How about you, huh? What's your deal? Last Alyssa. Boo! Did I scare you? You know what? You did a little. You did a little bit. I was mostly scared that you could see me from that far away and stop me in my tracks. It's a tortles. Or is it a tortless? Let's go snowball. One hit, one hit. It was level five, so it was gonna happen. Hi, tortless. Oh, another tortless! Never mind, not goodbye. So you did surprise me. It's like boo. It's a second tortless. Yes. Up speed leveled up. Wow. More speed. More magic attack. Some HP. A lot of HP. Wants to learn bark. <gasps> oh no. This is always where I started going wrong in Pokemon. And uh, yeah, I mean really early on in the games. <laughs> is in choosing which things to get rid of and which things to keep. I always made my Pokemon less effective by doing this. Um, let's see. We probably want to allow Pupski to go fast and defensive like he's been trying to. Let's double check the stats. Did magic pull ahead? No, physical pull ahead. Okay, well, so let's go with physical. If it's. If this one probably is. Now this is a basic support, okay. Barks aggressively, annoying the target, lowering their defense and magic defense. Do we want that? We've already got two supports. Let's see. This one lowers attack, this one lowers defense, and this boosts its own attack. I don't know if any of these are going to be critical to keep over having um, a straight up actual attack. Um, but this one has got more uses than Lick, so I might just replace that for that reason. Um, oh, but Lick actually does damage. Hmm. This part better than how. Boosts on attack versus lowering defense and magic defense. Because they're essentially equivalent. Except for this one, goes for both types. So let's replace Howl. Yes. Oh, I see. All right. I scare attacked and it didn't work. Yeah, I was spooked a little bit, but I wasn't spooked enough to lose a battle. Sorry. In fact, you helped my pup become very strong, actually. Yeah, I was right. There's going to be unavoidable tall grass that I could have been catching in. That's fine. This looks like a secret. Oh, I get it up there. What about this? Nope. Hello. Are you a monk? Monk Gearish. Top collected. Get ready to fight. Sure. I mean, you look kind of angry, but that's just me. Roskoon. Oh, Roskoon? Either way, go to Q. Let's go for the fight. Yay. Party bug! <laughs> oh my god. That looks amazing. Oh, bites double super. Wow. That funky fresh boy. I hope that party bug has a good life.
Pop out next to me because he's cute. I feel like this is a snake. Is this a snake? I feel like it's the sushi no girl. It's like a fat snake with legs. Axolotl says, use code 3K, 30K bunny. Sure. Expired. Thanks anyway. Yeah, it's not working. Thanks though. Three striped capsules. Let's see what those are about. Higher chance to capture. Pretty good. Magical banana? Pardon me? Pardon me, magical banana? Temporarily raise its magic attack. Oh, oh, oh. I see. Is there anything up here? Would there be? There won't be. Why is it so easy to climb if they don't want me to climb it? Weird. Oops. Oh hey, Kid Ryan. I want to be an insect type tamer. Oh, you're in the right place. Also, I've got the right right Pokemon against you. It's time to bite. Get erased. You can't send a level 4 against me. Come on. Well, okay, you can send to level 5, but I don't think it's going to help. Yeah, it did not help. I won one, one hit killed. And I'm only getting stronger. Oh, a level six, you know? You're taking my advice, but I don't think you're going high enough. Oh no! I got poisoned and doomed. That's okay. That's why I bought the antidote. That's okay, Pupsy. We'll be okay in a minute. I'm just gonna do it right now. Actually, this is my favorite. A level seven, huh? Finally, two hit. Poor person. Is that the one that does the damage guy? Okay, you level. None of it in defense. Maybe insect types are the strongest. You know what? They could be. Remember Alteran Venonat? That was the strongest bug. That was pretty strong. Defeated the Elite Four. I'm not sure if I'm going to need healing yet. Yeah, I'll do some healing. 
There we go. I don't know how bandages help against poison damage, but that's fine. I'm running from this nibble. I don't want to get poisoned again. I only had one after it. Alright, hey, wait a moment. You're a new tamer, aren't you? It's my job to help guide newbies. My name's TJ, and I've lived in this town for the past five years. <sighs> oh, Ooh, sorry. <laughs> I'll give you a tour. Come on. Thank you, TJ. Follow me. It won't be long. TJ's so nice, you guys. You guys, TJ's so nice. Welcome to Lakewood Town. Follow me. I'll show you around. There's two poodles in the This is called Main Street. Pretty good name, right? Mm -hmm. You just are now only hearing the important bits. The bike store. <sighs> I don't see Old Man Timothy anywhere, though. Maybe it's closed. This is the famous lake we're known for. Every year it keeps shrinking. Despite that, you can still actually encounter white wild tools in there, I see. If every year it shrinks, then I don't think it was an original. Why are houses right next to it? The subway lets you stay for jobs over cities. Which have had some complete disarray since I did go to the top of the repair. They soon will be fixed eventually. Hold on, I'm gone. There's so many yawns in my face. <sighs> this is called a doodle station. These types of buildings will be one of the most important buildings on your adventure. You can buy items, cover your doodle's health, and access your doodle storage here. Come with me, I'll show you inside. Makes sense. It's a Poke Center plus a Pokemart. Of course. This is the shop we buy items. Yay. Storage. <laughs> that line, modern technology sure is convenient. I'm pretty sure that was like directly from the Pokemon games. Lastly, this is where you can do your tools. So let's just talk to the doctor here. Hi, Rebecca. Hi, TJ. Glad to see you again. I'm guiding this new tamer around town. Can you tell us what you do? Of course. I'm licensed to operate the machine behind me. This machine uses doodle code technology to restore your doodle's health. Just talk with me or any doctor and we will help you out. Whenever you lose, you'll, you will rush to the last station to heal that. That's good to hear. This island has been affected by so many thunderstorms and hurricanes as of late. It's hard to find keys for the key hunt when routes are blocked off by debris. Wait, you're doing the key hunt too? We will probably meet each other again because I'm doing the key. I'm doing the key hunt too. Remember to heal your doodles by talking to the doctor. Bye. Bye, TJ. Have fun. I'm I'm weirded out by the fact that. Doodles are apparently computer programs, but like 
doctors are the ones who heal them. I can understand the machine, but why can I talk to any doctor and be able to heal a program? <laughs> like, I get that they're pulling from Pokemon, but uh, I think something got lost in translation. <laughs> Duco Pharmacy. I don't think that's what a pharmacy does, but that's totally fine. Refill the ink. Uh, oh, it's a printer? It's a Doodle Depot. Do you want to look at her wares? Yes. My wear hands are Um, all the other stuff I don't want yet. Change the staff releases. Hmm. I'm just gonna buy one just to figure it out. And I don't think we need more capsules. And I don't really have enough trouble with battles to care about switching my games yet. Well, I might as well take a look at the storage. <laughs> it's this guy. What is a plipo? Please tell me. It's a basic. A plipo is a basic. Poor plipo. Don't let them insult you like that. It cannot be enraged or confused. This plipo is sharp as a tack and cool as a cucumber. Ridiculous. These are guys who are not the only words from the type of So this is like the Meowth. Gosh, he's adorable. Look, he, he doesn't even attack. He asks for money. He does cute squeaks. He licks your hand and he has good defense. That's it. He doesn't, he's not even a monster. He's not even a combatant. He's a civilian. I mean, like, come on. And yeah, Clippo is a girl. I have a bad habit of calling everything he. You know, ironically, it's not in the way that other people call everything he. It's the sort of, I don't know, for some reason, if something's cute, that makes it a he in my brain. I, I don't know. And not just things that are actually alive, but also like buildings, food items, just anything. Is always he and a boy. Like, I was trying to give somebody directions, and I'm so embarrassed about this. I'll never forget this. As somebody was, um, I was giving somebody directions, and I pointed down the road, and I said, yeah, you're gonna want to turn left after that big red boy. And they're like, what? And I'm like, left? And they're like, no, what? And I'm like, oh, I'm so sorry. I mean, the brick building. <laughs> <laughs> it's like, in my head, Brick Building and Big Red Boy are the same thing. Anyway, um, let's see. I'm gonna move, uh, Niblin behind because, frankly, I'm scared of her. I mean, like, Niblins are intimidating. Goodbye. <laughs> I'm gonna storage one and hang out. And, um, look at this cute, ridiculous. Honestly, I'm, I think I'm gonna keep behind all the little ones, all the little buggies and everything, because I'm probably gonna start catching like level tens in the wild at some point. And, uh, probably not gonna have time to train them. Up. Oh, they're so cute. I will leave the bird behind, mostly because I'm not a huge bird dude, but 
but I know that the boys be there. Morbo. What a cutie. I should probably name these two. Popsky is a cute name, but I think Popsky needs a name. So, let's see, let me think for a second. Um, you know, the first thing that came to mind was Ice Ice Baby, but I don't know about that. You know what? Ice Baby is not a bad name. I think that's great. Alright, the Pubsky's name is Ice Baby. And the Bangalux? Um, your control, you're fast, you're lightning, you're good at catching. Um, Broad Animations says, I think game music volume is too loud compared to voice volume. Thank you. Feedback like that is very important. If nobody tells me, it'll just be bad forever. All right, All right let, let me, me, I'm, I'm doing, doing a sound, sound check. check. And uh, it seems, seems totally, oh, oh you're, you're right. right. It's, it's way, way bad. bad, hold on. Hello. Hello. Okay, okay is, is it better? better? It, it should, should be, be way better. better. <laughs> I'm, I'm so, so sorry if this whole time people were struggling to hear me. I was, I was making, making some great jokes too, but that's, that's totally fine. fine. Okay, okay, let's see. Um, blah, 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 blah. That's, that's probably good. good. Okay, cool. I thought I checked it before, but I must not have done it correctly. <laughs> that's much better. That's so great. Broad animation, seriously, thank you so much for letting me know. <laughs> That's important. You get, you get kudos from me. Kudos to you. You know what? For that, because you're so helpful, if you want to, you can name the Bengalux. Because I'm not sure what to name them right now, but I think you've earned it. So let me know if you if you want to come up with a name or not. And if you do, I'll change the Bengalux's name. Also, I think I know who you are, so if I do, wink wink, welcome to the stream, I'm glad you're here, and if I, we have not met before, then cool beans, I'm happy you're here, welcome to the stream. <laughs> That's the character limit for names, um, it's probably not that long, but I didn't really check, let's see about that. Yeah, okay, perfect. I'm glad you're here. I didn't think anybody was gonna have the patience to check it out. Okay, so we basically got infinite name length. That's great. But I would like it to be uh, short enough that it's readable from a distance. <laughs> we got 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. We got about 10 before it gets ridiculous. Can you believe I do this every day? Starting from whenever I started. Every day, except on the weekends, or if I fall asleep. <laughs> oh yeah, sorry if I look or sound weird, I'm drinking a soda. And um, also, Bond Animations, if you haven't already, you can always join the Discord or check out the YouTube. There's gonna be a really cute animation I'm gonna post there. This is gonna be great. So yeah, let me know if you get a name for Bangalore, whatever you think of one. Benny sounds like a good name. Yeah, I don't know why I keep saying Bangalore. It's like the Apex character. Benny is great, thank you. This is perfect. All right. Bangalux is now Benny. We got Ice Baby and Benny. Perfect. This is excellent. Thank you. These are great names. Hi, Ice Baby. Okay, there's like a garbage truck person. Hello. I'm on lunch break, so I will talk to you. I drive this here garbage truck there in Bulaco. For such a small, serene town, Lakewood does produce a lot of garbage. <laughs> I like this guy. Let's talk to this person. 
I think there's more than just tadpole in this lake. I've been looking for a moss, a doodle which used to be more common than food. Since Doodle Club built a station here, our prized lake has shrunk every year. I would love to see a moss. What is Doodle Club doing? Are they secretly evil? Forever Chuck person has a nice tan, haha. Uh -huh. I didn't notice. I assumed that they were like a person of color or something. But come to think of it, they're kind of orange. If these guys evolve, I would love to see what Ice Baby turns into. Camera Todd. <sighs> I can't get the right shot composition. Oh, hello. I'm trying to get the perfect shot of a fruit head, but my hands are too cold to take a proper picture. You seem like you'd be a good photographer. Would you like to try to make it worth your while? Yeah! I'm actually a pretty good photographer in real life, so I know the, I know the feel. Camera mode now. See how the picture's unfocused? You want to take the picture when it's not blurry anymore. Okay. I understand. <laughs> this picture's way better than any picture I could have taken. This picture's good enough, but it could be better. Want to submit this picture? You can't read really this movie and submit this picture. I don't see how it could be better. It's great. I'm submitting. You've taken a really good picture. Here's your reward, a spectator camera. Noise. Spectators of people's battles. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I see. Should I go straight to capturing in the lake or should I look around town more? I kinda wanna look around town more. This is the bike shop where nobody is manning the station. This is a player? No, it's an NPC. I love my rough fire. Isn't it so cute and ferocious? Absolutely. This rough fire looks angry. This rough fire looks legitimately pissed off. <laughs> I'm so sorry, rough fire. Whatever somebody did to you must have been bad. You can just walk in the house. Hello, talk to me. I'm in your house. Yo, leave me alone. I'm gaming right now. <laughs> That's amazing. Sorry for intruding, bro. I'm just very nosy as a person. Just like my personality is to be very nosy. That's the only way I can explain it. Gotta get that chest out for checking out this house. Hello? Hello? I'm here to mess with you. Have you ever heard of misprints before? In this context, that sounds interesting. When a doodle's created, there's a small chance that it's a special different color. Show me the one that you caught yourself and I'll give you something. There's mm -hmm. shinies. Fun fact, the Japanese word for shiny Pokemon, the word they use doesn't translate exactly to shiny. It translates to something that is like maybe shiny or a different color. So the translation they used in English was maybe the wrong one. But either way, it, uh, the, the, the word means like an off-color Pokemon. I'm trying to watch this episode of Dancing with Doodles. It's a reality show where top tamers try and teach their doodles how to dance. <laughs> That's so cute. I love that. I would watch a show where they try to teach dogs how to dance and they dance with the dogs. For sure I would. Actually, I believe that's just like dog show. Like, um, like there's a specific kind of dog show where they do like obstacle courses and tricks and stuff. Those are cute. Now, three bandages. The type of dog show stuff that I don't like is when it's all about like you know, trying to measure up to a specific breed standard. It's just like, your dog has to be 73 inches tall exactly, and it has to have a tail that curves at a 45 degree angle, and otherwise it's not a real chihuahua or whatever. I like, I hate that stuff. That's like, to me, like, I couldn't give less of a crap the details of what a dog looks like. It's like, it's either a good dog, 
or it's a maybe not as good of a dog, <laughs> and that's the only thing that matters. <laughs> I was gonna say a bad dog, but let's be real, there's no such thing as a bad dog. There's only good dogs and dogs that have bad owners. I wonder what my boys in the backyard are doing. Well, I guess I'm about to find out. This is our territory, punk. We're the coolest triplets in all of Lakewood. Oh, your triplets and your territory is your backyard? Okay, that's fine. I'm the leader, Noir. Is that what your mom named you? And I'm the second in command, Rouge. Yeah, are you French? Because, uh... <laughs> this is the part where you introduce yourself, Blue. Sorry, 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 sorry. I, I mean, I'm Blue. You probably want this chest next to me, right? If you can defeat all three of us in a row, it's yours. Are you prepared to fight us? Yeah, absolutely, Nerd. Let's do it. Rouge, you fight him first. If it's not clear, their names are black, red, and blue in French. Okay, boss. Why would you call your brother who's the exact same age as you? Boss. <laughs> Rouge is a nice smile. Yeah, he's got a permanent shine mark etched into his teeth. I think that's a medical condition. <laughs> that's a bite. Bite bug. Bug bite bite bug. Yeah. Agatoad. Aww. Luigi Toad. Snowball. Frogs hate the cold. Super effective. Oh, I defeated him. You're gonna lose to Blue, I can feel it. I bet Blue is super little prodigy. It's just super good. Wait, did they get erased when they die? Yeah, it's like a metaphor? Because they're like a computer program or something. Or maybe they're like printouts? It's not clear. None of the physicality of these creatures is made clear at all. I mean, they seem to be generated by computers, but they also seem to be bouncing around in the wild for no reason. So, it's all very hand wavy. <laughs> uh, you're certainly tough. The next fight will be even more difficult. Yeah, it might be. That's fine. Blue, that means it's your turn. I'm so pathetic, please forgive me. Man, this... This man's self-esteem is in the absolute trash can. It's my turn to fight! Listen, Blue, you're probably gonna do fine. Relax. Triple Blue is to battle. Who sends out Ice Beam? Larvene. Ah! Ah, security! Let's bite. Bye bye, cutie! Yeah, they're, the, the creatures are called Doodles. This is like Doodle World. So, they're all, they made of like sketch lines and stuff like that. Look at the Muttfish! What a baby! I would hug the Muttfish. And so, yeah, the eraser comes in when you think. Ooh, that my defense, huh? We're getting intimate, apparently. Yes! That was a two hit. See, you did better than your brother. <laughs> your Pokemon weren't both one hits. <laughs> no, 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 no. Don't worry about it, Blue. Your older brother got this. What, you came out of the room one second before the other two? Is that why you're the leader? That's such absolute BS. If I was a twin, I would, I would put my older twin's head in the toilet and flush it. I would refuse, refuse to be the younger twin. It's ridiculous. They're the same age. I'm the strongest for a reason. No, you're not. You made it up. He might actually be better trainer, but we don't know yet. At least he's got more of them. The other two only had two each. 
who I can't do bite again because last time I did one of the it's poisoning me. I don't think I bought another antidote. Maybe I did. Either way. Oh no, they're gonna poison me anyway. Oh no, it's fine for now. Okay. Let's try again. Yes, we did it. Nice bug. God, what a cutie. Fight, fight, fight. Ooh. Level 8's aren't too bad, huh? Definitely need late. It's not the first time a dog licked a bug and it won't be the last. Yeehaw. Pursuit? Oh man, now we're gonna have to figure out moves. Hold on. Dark physical power 60. That's not bad. An attack move that inflicts double damage if used on a further switching out of battle room. Um. Hmm. Hmm. We, we do seem to have a high speed, a high speed creature here, so this might be super useful. Plus, it's 60 anyway. So, Snowball and Biteable 50, and they're all accuracy 100, so it doesn't matter. Um, do I want more physical? Because he is better at physical. So I could get rid of Snowball. I, I kind of like Snowball, but it seems like the way I'm going to Or maybe I should go to Bark, because I already have another support that actually does the energy. Yeah, I'm going to get rid of Bark. I never use support moves anyway, unless they're really good. Alright, now we'll have plenty of attacks, so it'll be hard for us to run out. That's good. Lime and hay. Another cutie. Right. And with the different types, it's more likely that we'll get a super effective on more battles. Yeah. Oh yeah, and when we send them to the hospital to heal up, they send them into a printer. It's like it turns more ink onto them. It's like they get smudged. It's funny. Ink prices in this town must be nuts. Yes! Evolve the baby! Evolve the baby! I'm glad that it asks you whether you want to do it. Oh, I forgot that sometimes you, they get better moves if you don't, but that's fine. That A Furzen? <laughs> Aww, he's so serious. Look at him. I can't believe it. You defeated the triplets of Lakewood. The chest is yours. Congrats. I got triple threat title and I got a new Aww. Look at my doggy. He's like he's like, I'm good at my job and I'm serious and I fight bark 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 bark. I do a fight. Bark bark. Look at him. He's like, I'm lanky now and I do a fighty. <laughs> it's so cool. Retribution scroll. What the heck eh? Stack what is this? Teachers to do with the moon of retribution. Let's see what let's see what it is. Oh, interesting. Brawn animations. Little phrases looks like the awkward middle stage. Yep. It sure does. Strength jelly.
the stars. Branches. Branches cause a problem. Oh my god. Is pushed in the speed is negative. Is that just their natural traits? Like for this individual? I think that's what it is. That's why we haven't been in. No, but we've been getting plenty of. Uh, I don't know what. This is not important. I'm not worried. Since I lost to you, I have to buy Nora an ice cream cone? No, you don't. Just say no. You're really strong. Do you want to join our group? You're a group of siblings. I'm not related to you. Go on, take the chest. It's yours. Did your mom tell you it's okay to give your stuff away to anybody who comes to your house and, like, fights you? <laughs> I don't think that's good. I wonder what my boys in the backyard are doing. You should check on them! They're having a bad time. I would be very worried about those children. What about you? Who are you, the secret fourth triplet? Vert. I tried to apply to be a part of the liquid triplets, but they said I was too weak. I challenge you! If I defeat you in a battle, the triplets must let me join! Well, since I defeated all of them, it would make you stronger than them if you defeat me. By the transitive property. Go, Ice Baby, you can do it! Pave the way, push back into it! A level two? Oof. Vert! This is why you need to grind more. You need to get back on that grind. Your bugs are beautiful, but if they're not level 10, you're gonna have a hard time. Ask baby game, save an experience. I guess I'll never be able to join the triplets. I don't think that's why. I don't think that's why you won't be able to join the triplets. I think it's because they're triplets and you're not related to them. I think that's the reason. Brown Animation says, I suppose it's kind of hand waved, like when you fight kindergartners in Rogue One. Yeah, I mean, like, I feel like if they're trainers who are out on the field, it kind of makes more sense. But when I invade their house and fight them in their own backyard and, like, <laughs> and take their stuff, <laughs> you know, it's like, hmm. It's like, that wasn't even their pocket money that they used for gambling on the street. That was just, I walk into their backyard and take something. Check out, this is how the healing works. Hello, and welcome to Doodle Co. Pharmacy. I can heal your doodles to full health using this machine. Shall I heal your doodles? Yes. And this is how they do it. Refill the ink. Yes, free! Welcome. Then to turn on the machine. That's how it works. It puts ink in them. Do you need to stand in the receptionist to heal? No, absolutely not, you do not. <laughs> There's no reason to. I was doing it because I am a goblin. Don't talk to cops. Why cop? Oh wait, we're gonna go to the lake. First I'm gonna switch to my creature capturing creature. Benny. B -b -b Benny and the Jets. Hello. I walk in the water and get attacked by a fish. Isn't that life? Oh, look at it. Are you kidding me? Amazing. 
Wait, that's kind of where I'm live. Oh no, wait, it's fine. Yeah, it's perfect. Perfect, perfect, perfect. Way to go, Benny, you did it. Poor Benny, looks like he's about to drown. You can barely see him. He's just like, all the way in the water. Got a pull. Run. Catapult. Run. We're looking for the second creature of the lake. There should be two. Catapult is one of them. And then the other one is the silhouette on that distant sign boy over there. I don't know if it's a 50-50 chance to get each of them out to battle, but we had bad luck, bad luck last time too, so I'm not really worried. Although, who knows what the actual uh, like spawn rates are. It's mostly tadpoles, huh? There's probably something I can do, like an item I can buy to make uh, more rare Pokemon show up more often. Let me double check that sign. Link it down. Wikipedia, one out of two. And that guy talked about it over by the lake. There's probably nothing more to do in this town than to just continue on the paths. Besides this one little thing. Catapult. Adorable. But I already have one. Moss. So even he was basically saying that they're more rare than the tadpoles, so that might be hard to find them. I wonder if I have to do something to bring it back. Well, I'm going to stand here in the water for a minute. I got to take a short break. I'll be right back.
I'm back. Hello. I think we're gonna give up looking for moss right now. It's possible it's just not even in the area. Looks like we might be able to go through this tunnel. It says go to Graphite Monster at 3. But I can go through this tunnel. This is the Lakewood Tunnel, it says. Got some spooky music. Looks like nobody can get through because there's a garbage truck in the way. I gotta say, for a Roblox game, this is pretty narrative heavy. Kid, there's nothing for you to see here. Me and my friends are inconspicuously blocking the entrance to this area. Yep. I see. That this has to do with the disappearance of the moss. I was at the hospital, they used their technology to save me. Well, I'm technically 5% doodle now. <laughs> nice. And then, of course, the caution came out to try to jump over, but I can't progress past. I, too, am 5% doodle. Like we have option. All right, a new creatures. Seen one of them before. Fairy Isle. That's adorable. This whole place is probably gonna be adorable. Let's start with you. How about? Cool Teen Flynn. I can't get to Route 4 because the roads are blocked. Let's pass the time by battling. Yeah, that's, that's fine. Benny! Glimio. Um. Let's do a taser before switching. Add the next. Laser versus taser. If that's a critical hit. Noise. That's a lot of experience. Benny leveled up. I was actually trying to avoid Benny leveling up that much. Electrified. Zip zaps the target. The next time the user uses a spark type attack, it becomes stronger. Power 30. We're replacing a squeak. That's going to take up, of course. It's crappy. Aw, it's the cute monkey Pokemon. Snowball. Two. One hit. Fifteen versus nine, one hit. I can't really complain about these results. Yeah, you did challenge somebody you knew nothing about. I happen to have higher levels, it's fine. Oodleco sure is a great company. Is it? Wait, I know that. Not for sure. 
I've seen evidence to the contrary. Presumably. Who are you? A, a businessman, Barney. Time is money, kid. I've made over three thousand and five hundred dollars during this conversation. Wow. That's so impressive. It's almost like he's taking the money from people who are working. Because he's not doing anything. Let's see. That's right. I kept starting with my capturing Pokemon. Well, let's just uh, wreck them though. Right. Quick strike, maybe? Power 50. Got the goods. At least I still have my money. There you go. I got exactly the amount you said you got. So it's, it's my money now. This silly person. Destroy Borbo. I defeated Borbo. Hiker Axel. Hiking! That's all he said. It's like he's a Pokemon. Hiking, hiking, hiking. Hi. Pablet. Look at these little pointy rocks. The little pointy rocks with faces. Oh, that's so cute. But you're bad at ice. Aha. -ha. I'm another Putski. I'm bigger than you. I win. Fight. Oh no, he used Howl. It won't matter. His bite. Yes. I game. This guy only knows one word. Okay. Yep, I am a king. Thanks for saying hi. This is like a drop down. Hmm. A monk? Monk Baldi. Can't believe my parents named me this. Why don't all the monks look like Theo? They're supposed to be calm. Wig lights! That's the problem, he's wigging out. I get it, it's a piglet with a wig. Why? But it's super cute. Apple. What's the cute cat? Uh, bite cat. Hmm. 
しなばイエスWhat's your strategy to have two bad creatures? Not much of a strategy. And I feel bad because I started late, but I'm probably gonna have to, have to end early too. I'm feeling myself fall asleep. And I know it's my fault again. This time, everything should have been fine, except I was playing all night on the weekend. Because I was really excited to get that animation done. Just shows to, just goes to show you if you don't sleep, you're just borrowing from yourself in the future. Beauty Sarah. Look at my doodle. Isn't that incredibly sweet? Probably is. These things are so cute. Wild Oh, I see. This one's not just cute, it's spooky cute. Let's try pursuit. Oh, one hit. Oh, yeah, yeah. I can't really complain about these results. You know, that's totally fine. All you wanted to do is show them off and, like, you know, mission success. What if she was just trying to show me, and then I took it as a battle accidentally? I'm just like, yeah, your dog's cute, smack. <laughs> That'd be so rude. Yeah, and of course that was a dog. Why wouldn't it be? All animals are dogs. That's what's important. That's a shark? No, it's a sea puppy. That's an armadillo? No. It's a round puppy. Is that a worm? No. That's a wet puppy. Is that a dolphin? No. It's a squeaky puppy. Is that a turtle? No. 
it's a hard purple. Is that a cheetah? No, it's a fast purple. So anyway, now that everything's a puppy, I'm definitely gonna take a break for the day and thank you guys so much for watching. I hope everybody has a really good day and I'll definitely be picking this up uh, again tomorrow and doing this game again because um, it certainly has not got old yet. Um, it's wild just how much of a map has been built even just so far. I have a feeling that they tried to go really hard and make like a full run one, or at least got as close as they could. So far it's played almost exactly like a run one, and uh, that's pretty impressive. So um, I definitely want to keep going with it. Um, so yeah, I hope everybody has a good one, and uh, thanks for coming to the stream, and stay down.